Today is Tuesday, just a fast morning. So the majority of the horses are galloping. As you can see, all the other foremen and strappers are saddling up horses, bandaging them, making sure they have all their gear on. And as you can see, there's, they're starting to come back from the track. It's up to me to try to make sense out of the chaos. It's just making sure the horses stay safe, make sure the workers are safe as well, and just making sure everything gets worked, everything gets looked after and done properly. Speedway's rolling hose. Emotional, just a hose. This morning we have 110 horses to work. It looks like madness from the outside, but it's all, all under control. No roll for her, Ashley. And can you give her a hexi wash, please? Being here for a long time, 29 years. My dad was a trainer, so I've been going to the track, saddling them, probably since I was a teenager. Before I had a pet cat, I had a pet horse. <laughs> they all got their own little bit of cheekiness to them. They all like to create havoc wherever they go. When you want the clipboard, let me see what's going on. <laughs> the first lot's done, so we move to the second lot. You mark the horses off, and we just wait for them. As soon as they finish their work at the track, they'll come back through, and it's all on again. Deprive, roll and hose, Shannon. We're up to lot seven, so there's still a good 30 to 40 horses to work. What are you up to? Working for Sheikh Mohammed. You know that they're going to get the best care of everything. I couldn't see them being treated any other way. I just like seeing them treated like they're the world. It's a whole team effort when it comes to looking after them. Everybody has their part to play really. You've got to be switched on, you've got to be doing your job properly and when that's done it, it runs smooth as clockwork. I better go and check these ones. This one's coming on our walker. He's moving from the pool section to over to mix. Yeah mate. You see them start off from such a young age when they're yearlings. You get to see them progress to two-year-olds and then they go out in the track and they, they show some fight and they want to win. You know that you've done a really good job with them. Badger, you're going to be the next one, aren't you? It's not all about winning, but it's caring about the horse. It's like, uh, you know, I don't have children. So it's like having your own kids grow up, see how they perform, see how they go out and race and if they're good, they're good, but if they're not, you still love them. You still, you still have a soft spot for them. She says, hurry up, I want my hay. <laughs>